Uh, Richard from New York. Uh, you're on with Madison here on Sirius XM's Urban View. Good morning, Mr. Madison. Good morning, Richard. Um, I think there may be another aspect of uh, Donald Trump's strategy here. And uh, first of all, I'd like to say I am not a Republican or have uh, uh, not decided on who to vote for. And uh, there's an awful lot to criticize all the way around with most every single candidate. But I think what he's trying to do is, first of all, show the Republican Party that he is his own man and that they don't tell him what to say. On the issue of uh, uh, LGBT, I think uh, it's reasonable to go along with the position of the progressive people in this country. When they're right, they're right. And I think that Mr. Trump, uh, sometimes at least, he will call it the way he sees it. Uh, as far as taxes, I don't think there's any problem here. He's trying to co-opt the, uh, Bernie and Hillary voters into voting him in the general election, if he ever gets there. How about that? Is that a theory that you can, you can, uh, you can see any validity to? Nope. No. Be- because because it, it is antithetical. It, 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 in essence, goes totally against, one, um, his party, his base. I think he's trying to appeal to a broader... A broader but you don't appeal... Yeah, but he's... Look, broader is the word. So that means you add on. You yeah. don't... And you, well, you can't... Add, you don't eliminate, you don't, come on, man, look, so what what freaking Republican have you ever heard says, I'm going to raise taxes on the wealthy? But he's not a Republican. But uh, listen, oh, Jesus Christ, I tell that to the damn millions who have voted for him in the Republican primary. Well, how about the millions that voted for Cruz and Kasich and... They're Republic. Oh, God. Am I losing my mind or is this something that I just don't understand? Am I missing something this caller is not... Sir, these are conservative Republicans. This goes against Republicans. Let, let, me, let me give you an example. Let me reverse it. Suppose... So if, if, what if tomorrow morning... On a national Sunday morning on a national show, Bernie Sanders said, I think we ought to cut taxes for the rich. You don't think that would make news? He first of all Hey, wait a minute. No, no, wait a minute. See, you're not gonna uh, wait a minute. You heard my question. Just answer the question. Don't change it. Oh, okay, no. It wouldn't make news? I, it would, certainly would make news. He wouldn't. He wouldn't do now, that. Now, so then, just flip it. Now you've got somebody who is part of the Republican establishment, or he claims he is. That's who he's appealing to, saying, "No, I, I want to raise taxes on the rich." Shouldn't that make news? It is making news. It's not. Oh, never mind. Never mind. I'm not. You know. Never mind. Never mind. I can't handle. I, you know. It, it, it's sure in making news on Fox and Friends. That's my point. So he, so in other words, he goes against the philosophy of the party to broaden. You're not broaden. What you're doing, it, I guess I got to put it where the goats can get it. You're pissing off your base.